Thank you for joining Olympus's virtual showcase. My name is Brandon Wrights. Today I'm going to show you our new and complete solution for easy and efficient longitudinal weld inspection. The new and innovative Axiom scanner coupled with the OmniScan X3 allows you to efficiently perform ultrasonic inspection on longitudinal and circumferential welds using up to four probes including phase array, Toft, and TFM technologies. We're going to get started with a general overview of the Axiom following some scanning of various configurations, and finally move into a live Q&A, so be sure to stick around until the end. The Axiom features a robust and ergonomical design, but is also very lightweight and easy to handle. This specific scanner is a four probe configuration, but is also available in a two probe configuration with various cable lengths. My favorite thing about the Axiom is a virtual toolless design. As we all know, when you get out in the field, inspection plans vary and you need to be able to easily adapt on the fly. Changes between different diameters or from longitudinal to circumferential weld scanning are made through two easy adjustable points by the simple thumb screws. In my experience, the weakest point on any scanner is the probe holders. Probe lift off is the biggest headache for any encoded inspection as well as probe skewing, which reduces the probability of detection. The redesigned probe holders has a user in mind with a stiff pivoting system, pressure adjustment with user replaceable springs, and a latching system to hold the probe in the upwards position. This is to keep the probe safe during handling and adjustments. Probe index offset adjustments are done using this quarter turn quick positioning lever that makes adapting to various thickness welds easier than ever. I mentioned innovation earlier, and that's where the Olympus ScanDeck module comes in, along with the OmniScan X3. The ScanDeck provides important information to the operator directly on the scanner and enables a remote operation of the instrument. While communicating directly with the X3, the ScanDeck features a coupling check monitor light to ensure good coupling and no probe lift off occurs during a scan. Not only is this useful during acquisition, but now the coupling check is integrated into the X3, the analysis or even a third party reviewer can verify that good coupling was held throughout an entire scan. Another key in collecting good data is missing scan lines. By exceeding the scan speed, you miss data lines and without having constant monitor of the instrument, there's no way of the operator of knowing. With the scan deck, being able to communicate directly with the X3, missing data lines is now in the past. As you can see, the red blinking light indicates the scan speed has been exceeded, notifying the operator that he needs to back up and recollect that area. The scan deck also features a built-in laser, which is powered through the encoder cable, along with a start acquisition button. This will reset the encoders once the scanner is in position and ready for inspection. Having these tools and information right at the fingertips of the operator without constantly monitoring the X3 allows for a one person crew while efficiently collecting good data. The Axiom's design has really simplified the role of a scanner technician and made it easy even for the entry level technician. For longitudinal seam welds, we can scan from six inch OD all the way to flat. Now let's get into the action. We're going to perform a scan on this mock 8 inch ERW weld long seam. First, we'll set the scanner in the start position. Press the blue button to reset the encoders. Now we're ready for data acquisition. As we scan across the pipe, you can see on the X3 screen that we're collecting good data. Now that we've exceeded the scan rate, we get a red light indicating we have missing data lines. So we're going to back the scanner up and proceed. And an example of probe lift off by our coupling check channel. You can see as I lift this probe off the part, we show a drop in coupling. And we're good. So we're going to back it up slightly and finish the scan off. Now that we finished the scan, let's take a quick look at the data. You can see in the data on the X3, the coupling check channels are located in the middle of the two C scan images. Blue across the entire scan length would indicate that there was no loss of coupling while gray signifies bad coupling at that scan position. 
On circumferential welds, the Axiom is capable of inspecting diameters from 4.5 inch OD with two probes and 10 inch OD to flat with four probes. Let's have a look at the seamless transition from longitudinal to circumferential scanning as we discussed earlier. First, we'll lock the probes in the upwards position. We'll lift the scanner off the part and set it down in the circ position. We're going to lock the brake to hold it in place. So we've only got two frame adjustments to make on the front probes here and to articulate the frame. So we'll loosen the thumb screws, pop them up in the top position, and we'll do the same for the back, and we'll lock it up. Now we can release our probes. Release the brake. And after those simple steps without the use of any tools or any additional parts, we're ready to start scanning in the circumferential direction. For large diameter vessels and tanks to flat plate applications, the Axiom scanner is still a great semi-automated weld inspection solution. As you saw from our brief demonstration, the Axiom Scanner and OmniScan X3 is a versatile well inspection solution. The ScanDeck module and toolless design make for a quick and efficient inspection even for a single technician.